The Pig in the Pond, written by Martin Waddell. This is the story of Nelligan's pig. One day, Nelligan went into town. It was hot, it was dry, the sun shone in the sky. Nelligan's pig sat by Nelligan's pond. The ducks went quack, the geese went honk. They were cool on the water in Nelligan's pond. The pig sat in the sun, she looked at the pond. The ducks went quack, the geese went honk. The pig went oink, she didn't go in because pigs don't swim. The pig sat in the sun, getting hotter and hotter. The ducks went quack quack, the geese went honk honk. The pig went oink oink, she didn't go in because pigs don't swim. The pig gulped and gasped and looked at the water. The ducks went quack quack quack, the geese went honk honk honk. The pig went oink oink oink. She rose from the ground and turned around and around, stamping her trotters and twirling her tail and splash, 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 splash. The ducks and the geese were splashed out of the pond. The ducks went quack, 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 quack. The geese went honk, 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 which means very loudly, the pigs in the pond. The pigs in the pond. The pigs in the pond. The words spread about above and beyond. The pigs in the pond. The pigs in the pond. At Nelligan's farm, the pigs in the pond. From the fields all around, they came to see the pig in the pond at Nelligan's farm. And then Nelligan came on his cart. Nelligan looked at the pig in the pond. The pig went oink. Nelligan took off his hat. Nelligan looked at the pig in the pond. The pig went oink oink. Nelligan took off his trousers and boots. Nelligan looked at the pig in the pond. The pig went oink 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 oink. Nelligan took off his shirt. Nelligan looked at the pig in the pond. The pig went oink 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 oink. Nelligan took off his pants and splash. Nelligan joined the pig in the pond. What happened next? Sploosh! They all joined the pig in the pond. And that was the story of Nelligan's pig.